Hi, this is Darren Fisher with our next episode of the Leadership Blog, and um, you might be asking yourself why do I don't have a helmet on and dressed in gear to go riding. Well, it's been interesting because this quarter, after my brother passed away, emotionally I haven't necessarily had, I don't know, I just haven't had it. So there's things that have been physically, it's funny, when, you, when you're emotionally taxed, mentally you can't go as long and it definitely affects your physical and so i haven't been able to really put in a lot of 40 hour weeks um i haven't been slacking still been out there selling but just not to the level that i've been accustomed to and the one thing that i could control though was working out so i've been doing a lot of biking i had uh, two major goals this quarter actually there were three sort of things i said one is i went straight pescatarian fish only for the quarter and uh, it's been really good for my system really like that the second thing was I wanted to swim for an hour. I did that. I actually swam for an hour and a half, which is 2.2 miles, which is pretty significant. And then the third thing was I actually wanted to do a 50-mile bike ride, and I actually did a 60-mile bike ride for, and those last 10 miles are crazy. But um, 60 miles, four hours, and it's really been good just to, to do something, and it's funny. When we look at things we can't control, and if we focus on those things, we'll actually run ourselves crazy. And if we focus on the things we can't control, we actually do have influence and can move the needle and get that positive reinforcement that you actually can do and can actually achieve. And so the point behind this blog today is this, that you can only control 2% really of the things that are happening around you. I say that even physically, you can eat the right things, you can, you can exercise, you can work hard, you can study, you can research, you can do all this stuff, but a lot of things that really affected, that are affecting us around us, that's the 98% that we really just can't even control. So focus on the 2%. If there's some physical fitness you wanna do, then lower the bar, do that. But ultimately, look at the things that you ultimately can control, find peace and rest in that, and then pursue that. Um, I don't know when or if I'm gonna get over my brother passing away. It's just something that's new, that's difficult for me to process because I've, I've learned, uh, thank, to my, thank you to my cousin Erica, that I'm really not good at processing a lot of my emotions. Not saying I'm emotionally dead, but just I suppress a lot of the stuff because you just sort of keep going. But it's okay to embrace those things. But given that, I still have to make sure that I am doing the things like taking care of myself, uh, doing the right things. It may take time for me to process that that death, uh, it may just take a while, and that's okay. I'm human, we'll keep working at this. Um, I look forward to hearing your stories. This is Darren Fisher. Uh, definitely be blessed, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.